welcome or welcome back. I'm Melanie Kate Love and today I have a what I eat in a day video for you to show you how easy and simple it is to make delicious and nutritious foods that are going to help cure and prevent diseases in your life because I've managed to cure my acne. I've lost 10 kilos. My digestion has improved. My eye color has brightened and I've never felt so amazing in my whole entire life. So today I start every morning off with um, some lemon water and I have about a litre and I'm making it lukewarm at the moment because it is winter in Australia. So what I'm doing is I've just finished a class of reformer Pilates and now I am just heading to the beach for some breakfast which is one of my favourite places to eat <laughs> because it's just such a beautiful scenery. Anyway so basically we've got some oats, I've mixed it with some hot water and soy milk, I've topped it with some flaxseed, um, peanut butter, lots and lots of berries, cinnamon and some apples. So I'm just enjoying this so up the beautiful sun rays even though I have a jacket on but it's just I just love the feeling of vitamin D in your skin and it's so relaxing and as I'm a fire sign I'm an Aries I need water to calm me down so this makes me feel amazing so for lunch we had a picnic today and this is my new new staple and my new favorite for lunch at the moment so what I've got is some turmeric rice, I've mixed it with some cos lettuce leaves, some hummus and some tomatoes, some salt and pepper and that is it. And it is so filling and it is so amazing and I love being able to get greens into my life which is incredible. And how easy is this? And yeah. That's basically my lunch. Now I had a little snack, a little afternoon snack with some apples and my favorite peanut butter. I'm so addicted to peanut butter and I love that Dr. Gregor from nutritionfacts.org recommends two tablespoons a day because that works fine by me. Um, I actually wasn't hungry after lunch and I was kind of like had my eyes were too big for my belly and I was like I really want some peanut butter anyway so that's basically what I had and then yet again I'm back at the beach yeah I love the weekends I make an effort to go to the beach as much as possible then I came home and I was like craving a sweet treat this is my Kuhlman chocolate slice this is one of my staples I make this every single week and I was a little bit fancy today, a bit of self-love practice coming in here. And I've basically just topped it with some melted chocolate and coconut and some strawberries. And this is my favorite. The recipe is coming soon, my loves. I know you've been hanging for this for ages, but I just wanted to just show you what I had. So for dinner, I wasn't too hungry. Um, I've just had some salad. And this here is a tahini maple syrup and water mixture. It's like I have it in equal parts. And I've just topped this with on some salad. It's so amazing. And it's just, I love eating fresh. It is winter in Australia, but today it wasn't super hot. So this is what I had. Okay, now let's go over on to Dr. Gregor's Daily Dozen app. Um, if you need to know how to find out, how to download it, there's a link in the description and it's a part of my How Not to Die series. So on this fabulous app, we have all of the Daily Dozen that Dr. Gregor recommends. So we're just going to go through and work out which ones do we tick off today. So let's go to breakfast. So do we have beans? We had soy milk in there so we can tick off one. Berries, half a cup of fresh or frozen. Yes, we had that. We probably have a little bit more, but I was a little bit generous, but that's okay. Fruit, I had for breakfast. Yes, there was one apple in that one. Flax seeds, yes, we had flax seeds. We had a little bit of peanut butter in there, but we'll get the rest later. Spices, we had that. Whole grains, yes, we had half a cup of um hot oats beverages for the morning yes i had one water before i went to reformer pilates and then i had one after so we can tick that off oh we can tick off that exercise for reformer pilates which is a killer workout okay um then for lunch we had the salad again so the salad we had well we had hummus in that so we can tick off one of that is this a tablespoon a tablespoon of hummus how much should i have oh let's just tick off one anyway Okay, then we had some, what else did we have? Oh, we had some greens, one cup. I would say I had two cups in there, so that's good to go. And then we had a tomato, so that's actually a fruit, so we can take a tomato off. And then, what else was in there? Um, oh, we had rice, we got to take off, what was the rice? How much is, da, 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 da. 
three servings a day, blah, blah, blah. I'm just taking off one cup of that. And then we had actually a cup of tea after that. So that was ticked off, perfect. And I think that was it. Okay, then we had the cool mint chocolate slice. So that was actually more whole grain. So we can tick off one of them because there's loads of oats in that one. There's some dates so we can tick off some more on that. What else is in there? Mm, I can't give too much away, but I think that's probably about it. Okay, then after that, we've had the salad with the tahini and maple dressing. So we actually, we can tick off our veggies because there's loads of veggies in that one, which was so good. Um, cruciferous vegetables, yes, we had some rocket in there as well. What else did we have? Oh, we almost ticked everything off. Beans, I didn't have any other beans. What else can we tick off? Beans, chickpeas. I don't think there was chickpeas in that salad, but oh damn it, well, we might have to leave that one. Okay, and then the other one, we can tick off our beverages because that is well and truly done for the day, that's no problem. One beans, good lord, we need to find us some more beans. Oh my gosh, my loves, we got so close. We got 96% of Dr. Gregor's daily dozen. Oh my goodness. If only we just had some chickpeas in that salad, then we could have got 100%. Anyways, we're going good. We did super well. Anyways, my loves, I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching today's episode. I hope you have enjoyed it. Please make sure that you comment below. Let me know, how are you finding these um, What I Eat In A Day videos? Do you actually want to see me on screen or you just want to see the food? Like, what kind of concept works best for you? So I just wanted to say thank you so much for the beautiful comments that I have received. I truly appreciate all your love and support. Wanted to remind you to continue to make better choices. I'll see you tomorrow for a Q&A about some nuts. We're talking about do nuts make you fat? and on Friday we have a guided meditation thanks so much for watching my loves I'll see you tomorrow love you love you love you and please make sure you subscribe hey everybody it's Peter here guest vlogger on Melanie Kate love today <laughs> Mel is concentrating hard on her cycle how are you going honey going good, going good. yeah she's doing great